Is this issue or any other issues on the team glaring enough to keep them from winning it all? Well, be only because the Western Conference is loaded with teams like Denver. I, I think the Celtics has currently uh, positioned. They're as good as any team right now in the Eastern Conference. It's when you get to a final series against a team like Denver or against a team like the LA Clippers where they're going to be really difficult to beat in the postseason. Do you have enough at that point? Right now, they're, I, I have... Despite the loss to Denver, I have zero concerns about this team. And I am a sky is falling type of guy. Like, I am, <laughs> I am pretty consistently lean towards the negative side of this conversation. But I love what Porzingis has brought to this team. I love the internal improvements that some of these guys have made. I love that Jalen Brown has not rested on his laurels after getting that big contract. Like I said, I do worry a little bit about the seventh or eighth man. But, you know, I'm 95% sure about this team going into the second half of the season. And I love the fact that you just named all those Western Conference teams. And you you have to face one Western Conference team in the playoffs, right? Look, I, they're, That's they're, it. Str they're stronger than Milwaukee. I think they're a better team than Milwaukee. They have owned Philadelphia over the last few years. You can't go into the playoffs thinking you're scared of the 76ers. You know, Miami, we'll see what Miami is when they yeah. get into the postseason. I think the Celtics are very strongly positioned to win the Eastern Conference. When they get to the finals and play a complete team like we saw in the Denver Nuggets, that's where I might be a little bit shaky.